contributor for Carolina Brew Scene. Uh, out here at Rocky Mountain Mills today. Uh, very special place for us here at the Brew Scene because it's now our headquarters. It's where we're stationed. It's where we're located. Uh, just to give you a little history, Rocky Mountain Mills is an area and a facility that is originally now just over 200 years old. First started out as a cotton mill. Uh, as far as we know from records, the second oldest cotton mill ever in existence in North Carolina. Um, but thanks to folks at Capital Broadcasting, uh, that group decided they wanted to invest in this location uh, to make it into something that's just as well received as the location they did in Durham. Uh, so now, Rocky Mount Mills is basically becoming a brew hub. Uh, there are several local craft breweries here already that put out their stuff for folks to try out. Uh, there's also several little eating establishments here that are great to come to. Uh, if you like to do pizza, Tipsy Tomato is probably one of the best little locations here in Rocky Mountain for pizza, especially here at the Mills. Uh, there's also Koi Pond Brewing. They have their own little house. There's TBC West. Uh, you can come and get your taco on Taco Tuesdays. Uh, there's also 1918. That's a little more of the upscale location for food. All of them are good. Definitely give them all a try, so that means there's something here for everybody. My Carolina Brew Scene Brew Battalion sweatshirt and hoodie. Um, and that's mainly for folks who are back us. Advertisers, people who love the magazine, uh, people who come out to events uh, such as beer festivals, any little brewery anywhere that we might have. So again, just wanted to show off this location, especially the Rocky Mountain Mills, uh, which like I said, is the home for Carolina Brew Scene. Uh, again, this is Corey Burton, contributor for Carolina Brew Scene, here at the Rocky Mountain Mills. Come out and see us.